Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing another Jeffree Star mystery unboxing of the deluxe Halloween box. These are always my favorite, these and the Christmas ones. If you're new here, which you probably are, I am normally not a beauty channel, I am a crafting channel, mostly doing embroidery art. So if you're not into that sort of thing, don't subscribe. But I do try to get all of the mystery boxes and we're just going to open it and see what's inside. So this box is $140 and it has $266 worth of product, I believe. And it is still available. All of the boxes are, I just checked. And this one has sizes, so we should get a clothing item of some sort. So when we first open it, we get the black paper. I'm trying not to look as I grab. We got a card for the skin line, which is coming soon. The only thing I know is in here is the Weirdo palette because he did announce that as part of his announcement, I guess. Ooh, so the first thing we have is a lip scrub in Witch's Brew. So let's open this up because I'm curious what it smells like. So these are sugar scrubs. There is the, sorry, there's a glare from my window. It's got the green. Ooh, it's licorice. Ooh, that'll be interesting. I don't like licorice. But I'm okay with the smell. I just don't like the taste. And it shouldn't taste like it, at least to me. I mean, there's probably a little bit of a taste of it, but since I'm not eating it anyway... It should be fine. Next up, we have a Supreme Gloss in Wifey. We are heading to the pumpkin patch later today, so... So this is a pinkish red. Next up, we have a Velvet Trap in ooh, Pure Hell, which I'm pretty sure is black. I might be wrong. I think the Supreme Glosses are my favorite lip product, mainly because I tend to go through lip products fairly quickly and it seems like these ones stay on for or it seems like the glosses stay on a little longer because I can just rub my lips together and then they redistribute the color and we got the velour liquid lipstick in unicorn blood so this is a red I don't know if I have this. I know I have this color in some products it might be in the velour lip, but got a little bit of stuff on it. But it is a really pretty red color. This is it next to Wifey. Then we have the gloss in six feet under and I think this is one I wanted to buy and I just hadn't yet but this is from the cremated collection and it is this dark gray 
pretty sure it's silver sparkle. So not quite black, but. Then we have, okay, so this is the Weirdo palette, which we will open up. It's got this cool paper. I always say I want to save the paper, but the sticker always mess it up. So there is the Unigarten. I have seen the palette already. I am not a fan. I'm a fan. I just don't think I'll be using a lot of the colors together, I'll, but I'll definitely use all my other palettes. But I'm a big sparkle fan, so Razor Blade is my favorite. Oops. But the Scene Queen is really pretty. This is not one I would have bought on its own, but I'm glad I have it for completionist collection. And there's the front of it. Um, for completionist, but also, like I said, to use it with other colors, like to me, a lot of the colors look the same, like it's a lot of grays and blacks, which we got in cremated, so, but it's fine. Ooh, this is cute. We got, I'm pretty sure it's a fanny pack. Oh, this is super cute. Oh, this is not a fanny pack. Okay. So it is a clutch. I was checking inside to see if there was a strap or anything. But it's got the little bat wings on the side. Is that vegan leather? And it's got the little vampire fangs on the logo. Very cute. I'm actually going to the Disney Halloween party on Sunday, so I might be bringing that along. We have a palette. I think I know what it is. Oh, nice. So we got blood sugar and it, there we go, it is the red. I forget if this is the one that had the white cover for the special edition or if that was the mini. Um, but just in case you haven't seen it, this is one of his, this is the one that launched the sugar collection or the blood collection. And it has all of those pretty Pretty reds and pinks, which I kind of thought might be in here. I thought it would either be this one or Bloodlust, because all the purples and blacks are good for Halloween. Although honestly, the Blood Money would have worked too, but he had that in the last one, I think. I didn't get that version, but. Then we have. Yes. Oh, there's one loose. Hang on. Oh, they're all loose. Okay. So we got the blue blooded lip kit. And literally the only one that is in place is that one. So if you give me just a second, I'm going to put them all back into place. sure why these popped out but but here 
favorite is the full rainbow. Well, blue rainbow. I have not ordered any of the vaults because they're any of the, I forget what you call these, any of the collections. Um, just because I get the colors I like individually, but it is nice getting them in the mystery boxes. So far I have this one, the nudes, and the queen bitch, which is the purple. I think our only item left is, yes, is our shirt, which I'm pretty sure is a t-shirt. Super exciting, I know, but when you see the back, hello, so cute. Like I said, I'm a sucker for Halloween, and so this will be perfect. So it's got the Black Widow, and then it looks like there's words at the top, but I can't actually see if they say anything. So I'm going to go with my mind playing tricks, maybe. But the Black Widow is awesome. And it's such an awesome color. So our exclusives in this one were the shirt, the lip scrub, and technically weirdo. And the bag. Whoops. He didn't actually say how many exclusives were in each box. Um, so four out of 10, I think is really good. And I think that with all of the red lipsticks um, and the whole collection, I think a lot of them will work well together. And like the, uh, the Pure Hell with the gloss. Yeah, look really good. So anyway, that is the entire box. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you like the products that you get in yours and that if you were thinking about getting the box, that this helped you out. So I will see you guys all. Well, if I get the next mystery box and it comes early, I will do a video on it. And so I am sure I will see most of you then. Take care.